Do you gentlemen give this lady to be with Willie for the rest of her, her life? Oh, my baby. <laughs> oh, my baby. <laughs> Today is a celebration. A celebration of love, of commitment, a friendship, a family, and of two people who are in it forever. You don't have to have a ceremony to have a marriage. And when you think about it, it's kind of weird. You're up here, all dressed up and fancy, everybody looking at you. So why do we do it? The marriage ceremony has been an important feature across uh, the cultures, religion, generation, and society. We have thousands of important moments that happen throughout our entire lives, but this one is regarded so critical that we share it with others. Why this moment? Despite all of our differences, love is what we all share. It's the great unifier, our one universal truth, that no matter who we are, where we come from, where we've been, what we believe, we know this one thing, love is what we do right. That's why you're both standing here today. And that's why we're all here to share with you. We all have loved in our lives and in every moment, we're reminded that the ability of love is the very, very best part of humanity. All of us here have our own love stories. Some are short, some are long, some are not yet written, while others are just getting started. There are chapters in our stories that are sad, disappointing, and others that are exciting and full of adventure. And that brings us here, a moment to pause, look back, and smile at all the moments that has brought us here. And a time, I'm sorry, and I'm here with you, as is everybody else, because we want you to have those moments. We want to support you, to be proud of you, and to remind you that love isn't a happily ever after. Love is an experience of writing your own story. It's not this moment, it's every moment. Big ones, like I say I love you. Moving in together, getting engaged, and having children. But mostly it's a bunch of little ones that equal up to the big ones. Falling asleep together, making dinner together, spending holidays with family and friends, getting that big hug that you really needed when you got home from work, or when you came out of the room because you worked from home. <laughs> <laughs> These everyday moments fused together to make one great big experience. And even though this experience is incredible, words fail us when we try to explain it. It's just the way love is. It's this moment that is felt, not described. We use words to write stories, poems, and songs, we all know Billy does great at that, <laughs> about love. And even though we describe love in different ways, and even though it can look different to each one of us, we all know it when we see it. We see it here today. So I decided I wanted to do a blessing of the hands for you guys. So if you guys will hold each other's hands. And just think about these words for the rest of your life. These are the hands that are your best friend. Young and strong and full of love for you. 
that hold yours on your wedding day as you promise to love each other every day, tomorrow, and forever. These are the hands that passionately love you and cherish you through the years and with the slightest touch will comfort you like no other. These are the hands that will hold you when you fear, when grief fills your mind. These are the hands that will countless times wipe the tears from your eyes, tears of sorrow and tears of joy. These are the hands that will tenderly hold your children. These are the hands that will help you hold your family as one. These are the hands that will give you strength when you need it. And lastly, these are the hands that will, when you're wrinkled and aged, will still be reaching for yours, still giving you the same unspoken tenderness with just a touch. Billy and Bree have decided to make a promise to each other. At this time, I'm gonna ask Billy to go ahead and do his promise. <laughs> When I first met you, I had nothing but a bag of clothes and a guitar. No money, no direction, not even a bed. <laughs> when I look back on all we've overcome, I know it's not what you bring to the relationship, but the life that you build while you're in it. Because of you, I have a son, a second family, a home. Probably most important, I have a coach. <laughs> and today, you give me one more thing and a partner and a friend for life. My promise to you is to never stop trying to be better. A better worker, a better father, a better spouse. You deserve the best of the best, and for that, I will always try to be you. Brianne, you ready to give your promise? Yes. Oh boy, okay. <laughs> I had no idea when I met you in a VFW. <laughs> where your papa did karaoke and my mom bartended for near to nothing tips <laughs> that you would give me the greatest blessing in this world which is our son our family that we've built together our home you have continued to fight to make all of our dreams mostly my dreams <laughs> come true because you love me selflessly I promise to love you with grace, that I won't try to be all I do is bitch, <laughs> bitch, all the time to pick my battles and accept you for who you are. I love you. She didn't have to have a paper to read that. I'm a little jealous of that. <laughs> all right. And then rings. Okay, so we'll let the gentleman go first. Repeat after me, I, Billy, take you, Brienne, to be my wife. In good times and in bad, there is no one I'd rather have by my side. You have made my future seem like more than just a dream. I will be your sidekick in adventures. I will promise to never stop playing with you. I will be there to make you laugh when you want to cry. Be there to make you laugh when you want to cry. <laughs> I will be your best friend, best friend, your lover, your lover, and your partner in crime. I'm in it for life. <laughs> hey, Brian. I, Brian. I, Brian. Take you, Billy. To be my husband. To be my husband. In good times and in bad. In good times and in bad. There is no one I'd rather have by my side. There's no one I'd rather have by my side. You have, oh I'm sorry, you have my future, you have made my future. <laughs> you have made my future. Seem like more than just a dream. Seem like more than just a dream. I will be your sidekick in all adventures. I will be your sidekick in all adventures. I promise to never stop playing with you. I promise to never stop playing with you. I will be there to make you laugh when you want to cry. Be there to make you laugh when you want to cry. I will love you as my best friend. I'll love you as my best friend, motherfucker. <laughs> <laughs> Lover. Lover. And partner in crime. And partner in crime. I'm in it for life. I'm in it for life. 
you're decent at DIY projects, okay? <laughs> 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 All right. Get the alcohol. I'm shaking. <laughs> and that one's in, uh, Emily's if you want to pass it. That's how we do it in the South, boys. That's right, baby. By the power vested in me by the Universal Life Church, I now pronounce you husband and wife. Woo! <laughs> <laughs> did you get it? <laughs> I didn't do it. Oh, did you get the? Lots of <laughs>